exist in what has become a very corrosive uh, process. Uh, John Bocheri knows this firsthand, the gentleman from Ohio. Thank you. Uh, good afternoon. I'm John Bocheri from Ohio's 16th District. Uh, today's Supreme Court decision, the regressive decision of the Supreme Court today, has just handed the keys of electoral government over to the corporations of this country. And we have seen as if the Supreme Court justices have rolled up to a drive through window and just supersized the campaign coffers of corporate America and their influence and undue influence that they have in the, in the electoral politics and in the influence of legislation. Enough is enough. The American people have spoken loudly that they want people elected to offices who are responsible to them and not the special interest groups that have so much undue influence in our electoral process and in the halls of government. We need to end this. Campaigns need to be about issues and ideas, not who has the biggest friends or the most wealthy corporate barons, but about issues and ideas. Congressman Larson's legislation will set the appropriate guidelines and balance. We all stand here today because we're deeply concerned about our democracy. We want to see a government that is responsive to the people. And this undermines a lot of decisions that state legislators have made. I've spent 10 years nearly in the state legislature of Ohio. This undermines so much work, so much effort that has gone into making the halls not only of Congress, but of, um, of our own uh, state legislatures more accessible to the people. So I stand here today firmly and strongly behind this legislation, and it's time we hand the keys of government over to the people. And uh, we need action and results not more supersizing of corporate campaign dollars involved in the electoral process. Both uh, Rush and, <clears throat> and John have made the point that it not only impacts Congress, but it also impacts our state legislative races and our municipal